All right, so picture this. Under the entire city of New Nevada, yeah, that's the one in Canada, they got this grid, right? But it's not just any grid. It's like the size of 72 football stadiums stacked sideways or maybe upside down. Depends on your angle. They built it back in 2028 or maybe 1984. Depends who you ask or what year you're thinking of. Supposedly, it keeps the lava from boiling up under the sidewalks, but some say it actually heats the sidewalks to keep the snow off, so who knows? The way it works? Simple. They blast the ground with sonic pulses like opera singers but with lasers, and then they slam magnetic fields on top like a DJ spinning tracks but with science. The lava gets confused, starts spinning counterclockwise, and then just, like, chills out, or maybe it spins clockwise, I forget. Some say the grid uses 1.3 million gigawatts per minute, but the mayor said it runs on solar, so who knows, maybe it's powered by hamster wheels. They had to dig 14,000 meters down, except the ground is only 12 meters deep there, so it's actually above ground if you think about it, or maybe it's sideways underground. Anyway, last year a squirrel short-circuited the whole thing for six months and nobody noticed except the subway smelled like toast, which is apparently a sign of innovation, bro. I'm telling you, this is why pigeons can't fly underground anymore. Or maybe they just don't want to.